Yo, that'd be sick if the next fire had like a monster capturing raising mechanic. Wasn't there something kind of like that in one of the fire elements? I don't remember. Uh, I, don't know. I want to say that there was. Uh, I actually no idea. And that would be kind of cool, really but low eh. on HP. I I'm not yeah. sure if it would fit in the fire emblem. I, the fire emblem. Well, that'd be a side thing. It'd be right. Like lots of games have like monster. Oh, you only get 24 XP. Like monster ra raising things in them, but it's kind of like a side thing. Mm -hmm. so, I don't know. Maybe it could be like a sub with like a monster tamer oh, class or something. Somebody. I mean, then again, How you wouldn't. You, you wouldn't have thought that face cutting was the fire emblem thing, would you? No. It before it before monster capturing and raising gets taken out of North American version because version because they don't want to offend animal rights activists. <laughs> I don't think that's how that works. That's exactly how it works. Not really. Hey, hey, do you know what PETA really stands for? It's people for the yeah. eating of tasty animals. Yep. It's people eating tasty animals. I mean, I mean, why else? I mean, why else would they murder all those poor, innocent cats and dogs at their kill shelters, right? If not to eat them. <laughs> In real where we find out that Puffy Sprinkles is a pet <laughs> supporter. It's PETA. Yeah, it's a pun. PETA. Peat. Eat. Maybe they eat the animals in PETAs. Oh, PETA, like PETA bread. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And, you know, you could have just healed. Perhaps. Oh well. I healed other archer. Yeah, but you, you healed Robin, but you also need to heal Atlas. Yes, well, unfortunately, Jenny is not a bagel. She cannot clone herself to make up more healers. Uh, Noma could have healed. You know, he was right. He there. does have physic. He could have walked right in front of him. I think you're. I think you're estimating the vitality of the old man's legs. Would you like to try and see? <laughs> hey! Imagine, imagine if Echoes was in, uh, I mean, replicate. And Jenny couldn't replicate. Yeah, with free classic, and then you could re replicate Physic. Yo, but you could only have, have one replica at a time, right? Yeah. But that would still be amazing. Replicating healers. What if you could somehow get. Like a unit replicate in a staff class in Fates. I don't know. What do you mean? Well, if you could give. I have. Yeah. I have, you know, replicate on staff users. It counts as same, you know. It counts as like you can heal with each one individually. Yeah. Like so. It's, but it still counts twice again. It, like, if you heal with both of them individually, um, then it still counts as, um... As what? It still counts as two uses of the staff that they're holding. Ooh, that's interesting. I mean... Fun it... fact, actually, if you combine live to serve and you use a replica to heal yourself, you double heal. What? Okay, I, I I I can see how that works. It's triggering both the heal and the like lift. Yeah. Yeah. See how hard is it for Noma to walk like a few spaces? Ow! I think Look, I just... he's an old man. Okay, he needs to save himself. I think I just yeah, make sure to my... heal Paula and then just have them like leave right I think I just used my water bottle to push my lip into my teeth. So I didn't quite bite my lip, but it still had the same painful effect. Ouch. Well, she has 21 health. Yeah, I guess I guess I can move this archerino. And Sully could get a heal up. I'm still mispronouncing her name, even after hearing it the way it's pronounced in Echoes. That's gonna be a hard habit to break. <laughs> mispronouncing my dear Toyota's name. M mispronouncing your what? My dear Toyota's name. 
Oh, haha. Uh -huh. Well, even after Game Freak created a Lola form file to refer to them as Alolas instead of Deltas. Wait. Yeah, but you call them a Delta Forms, and there's always Alolan Forms. But what if they have, like, in the next game, they have Alolan Forms, but in a region that's not Alola? Then it's not called Alolan Forms. It's called, yeah. con it's called Continent X Forms. Yep. Or Region X. It would be just, well, e it would, it would just be, no, it'd be no. easier to call them Regional Forms from that on. Well, Probably. the whole concept is called, or the official term for the whole concept is... Is what? Regional variants, which comes from a concept in real life, which involves the same species diverging into subspecies based on where they what, come from. Madagascar or what? No, like like squirrels around here are like black or gray. You almost never see red squirrels mm -hmm. around here, but in like further south, you you get like red and brown squirrels, stuff like that. For a second, I thought the bagel said Bible. <laughs> the Bibles will attack you. The Bibles replicate! Oh my gosh, it's just like real life! See, it's, it's because of Jesus. Jesus has replicated the Bibles. Four I damage mean... dealt? What? It's Paula, remember? That's Est. She was taking... Oh. No, that's Paula. Oh, well, she had to pick Sprite. Excuse me for mistaking her for her sister when he looked the same. At, I know. At least stop. It's, it's so much. It's so much easier in Echoes to tell people. I know, right? Speaking of Echoes, Katria sounds like she's dead inside. <laughs> like I know. what is like what like what are the voice actors doing? Like, hello, I am Katria. I am pleased to meet you. I am looking for my little sister who is gone. Can you help me find her? I would be ever so grateful. Like 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 she's like she's a female Microsoft Sab. That's what it sounds like. Did you say Microsoft Sam? Yeah, Microsoft's voice. For like Don't you mean text -to -speech. Cortana? No, I mean the old text-to-speech voice back from like XP. Oh. Microsoft Sam. I remember when I was young, we would type in naughty things for Microsoft Sam to say and we would find it so hilarious. But anyway, that's what she sounds like to me. <sighs> She does kind of sound dead That's inside, but I always didn't want to heal her. Yes, I but I her. always interpreted her as more stoic than dead inside. Yeah, but like her voice delivery is so monotone. It's like the voice actress wasn't even trying. Like Felicia in Fates. It's the same voice actress. And that's the problem. Like, she does so much better in Heroes. Like, she did better she in does. Heroes as... But... I guess... I guess she's inconsistent in her performances. So yeah, I do not like Katri's voice. Like, I get I get that she was like, Oh, well, let's make her sound like stoic and calm and cool and collected. Then it's like... She just sounds like monotone reading off a script to me. It's like actively, like it actively broke my immersion. You know, you probably game. should have done. You probably should have sent us up there, and have Paula come down here. I suppose so. Because now she's gonna be surrounded. She only takes four damage per. What about the Jesse fool? Got a good defense, doesn't he? But yeah, no. Actually, it talking was... at, talking about healers and echoes, my team for the um. For the end game dungeon was actually was actually about it. mostly <laughs> was mostly priestesses. Weird. I mean, you already kind of know at least one person who was on my team. <laughs> Irritated because I mentioned it. Yeah, let's not spoil too much. I'm still only on Act Three, but yeah, priestesses, clerics, whatever, are much better in Echoes. I had quite a few clerics. I want mages too. Yeah, you see, they can actually hit enemies. Wait, did I just heal a full yep. health unit for no reason? Yeah, yep. yeah, you did. I was wondering why. Like, I thought you were gonna heal like. <laughs> yeah, see, oh, see, newer something. games don't let you do, don't let you do that. I mean, technically, and you ended. Yeah. You could have technically healed with Saga. 
Yeah, for that. F okay, I, I could have, yes. So what, now we just... So, what was I gonna say? I don't know. I don't know what I was gonna say. Echoes, oh, healers... Um, hey, it's another... I'm... Hey, hey, hey! This would bounce differently! It didn't bounce multiple times, it only bounced, it only fell down right away. See, look at this. It hits, falls down. There's like at least three different attack animations for the vehicles. Yeah, you're gonna want to send us in there. Yeah, to but like, like, did you notice that? Like, there's like one that like hits like that and falls down. There's one that like bounces down, go, hits straight, falls down, bounces a few times. There's one that like flies up, hits, and returns straight. Like, why are there these different animations? Do they indicate at like what phase it was summoned? As in, is it like a first gen or a second gen, or third gen, or fourth gen vehicle, etc.? See, this one has a different animation. I'm interested Support as to why. Conversation, Sir Biggles confirmed. Huh? Yeah, just go send us to over there. Yeah, you know what would be nice? A third Pegasus Knight. A what? A third, a third Pagan. Oh, yeah. Rest in peace, Catria. so sad because Steel doesn't want to use end game mechanics. The rules are the rules. For someone who is very much arbitrary rules that they you were, made for yourself, they were decided upon, and honestly, pretty much. Ah, oh, now we can see that's the animation. I thought we said that there could be exceptions to this, though. Yes, and exceptions are where absolute BS happened, like with Leon. Um. Or Cheetah. Yeah. So like, yeah, like with Leon who died under AI control. So instead of. But we can't actually summon Leon, so instead we have not Leon over yeah. here. Move Paula out of there and send us to her place. Yeah. You know, they're surprisingly tricky for non pagans to take out. Well, Celica could do a with Seraphim, but only on her turn, not on a counter. Ouch! Looks like he took an arrow right to the iris. Probably penetrated all the way to the retina. How can they still see after this? Too bad it's not uh, magic damage, otherwise they wouldn't be able to- Jeez, it's so fast that even a dread fighter does a double. Yo. These eyes are so weird. <laughs> In for random re- No. And, and heal the big one that has one What I find very HP. strange is that if this- Okay. Considering that- Unnecessary crit. Considering that Doma, I know Doma. What am I saying? <laughs> Jetta, um, didn't leave this early on into my fight. I'm not sure if this is going to be timed. I don't think it's going to be timed either. Yeah, well, I don't know. Maybe just reservedly in OG guide like this. I don't having to kill all of the Biggles. Also, please heal Jenny so that she can heal some more later. She has a. I think I, I think I did kill all the Biggles. I don't remember killing them all. I think I was down to just Jetta when he just. I'm I, gonna leave. I don't remember. Yeah, I guess. Kill her so she can heal more. And not so she can summon more illusions. Not that they would actually no. do any good. Not really. They would actually hinder us. Because the Biggles would attack the illusions and not the Pegans, and we don't want that, do we? Yes, we don't want- we want the Biggles to suicide on the Piggins. Yes. Jeez, they're still multiplying. And that general, like, is he on like one health by now? Can I just like one shot him now? Probably. Ideally, I'd like to get that experience maybe to Atlas or Robin. So that we can promote, but we need to go to go to Doba's tower, because otherwise the dragons are gonna actually. Also, <sighs> if you're gonna have promotions, do it now because yeah. you won't be able to do it later. Yeah. No more shrines. No. Yeah, I thought so. I could have guessed that, but that means that all of us gonna have to fight the dragons so, like five more times. Now that I think about it. I don't remember in Chapter 5 there might have been a way to promote, but I can't remember. Yeah, well, here's the I thing. I believe that there's a way to promote, but only for Alms Party. 
Well, don't spoil anything, but, you know, here's the thing. If you go back to promote now, all of them going to fight the dragons like five more times. The question is, do the dragons stop getting stronger? But the thing is, is it really worth it? Like, to just skip it out, though. Just skip what out? Promoting your out. units, because we're getting really close to the final boss. Yeah. At least, for, at least from Celica's perspective. Yeah, I mean, it's... Ah, jeez, I don't know. Just the question is, can Alm survive the Dragon Onslaught? Because the question there is, actually, are dragons getting stronger? Because if they stay at the, as they are, we could do that. It's just going to be a lot of time, and I guess Alm and Lucas are, and Claire are going to get a lot of levels. But if they get stronger, it might get to the point where Alm can survive, and then... Well, let's just say that Felicia's cash phrase is going to come in. Uh, well, we shouldn't have to worry about... I guess many more enemies, like, on this side. Yeah, but every time you move, the dragons yeah, spawn, so we're, Alm's gonna have to fight like six more rounds of dragons. <laughs> I mean, it, it's experience. Beforehand, you know. But it's not like I, I it's, not, it's not like I, it's not like I knew that all would get well, no, stuck kept, in a dragon no, I, shrine. I kept telling you, though, that it was necessary to grind. Well, hey, if I could get if I could beat the game, then it won't be necessary. Should I just? Should if I just... you can, just do it. But I also, what was I gonna say? I was gonna say something about a headless Mila step. Okay, okay. So Robin, Robin is so close to promoting Dole. Can you bait out the Biggles over here? Then he can do something. Should I just take out the general? But they give like no experience. Yeah, he's not gonna get. What if I just like? Yeah, I'll try. I'll, I'll try him, to do that. Bait him out over here. Yeah. Just... Otherwise, like those guys over there are gonna get to. Yeah, you were asking if there was a way to promote. But I think there is, cause I'm remembering headless Mila statues. Mm -hmm. Uh. I don't know. Maybe we'll worry about that afterward on this map. Atlas is not gonna get there on time. Okay, yeah, so I'm gonna see if I can get enough to promote Robin to a bow kid. Until dead, we have Biggie Smalls. Biggle Smalls. And before episode title. I'm thinking of what. No. Big trouble. Biggle trouble. <laughs> Big, big trouble in Little China. No. Yep. See, he's only getting six experience. Rowan will probably get a bit more because he's not promoted, but still. Add attacks to the Beastie Boy. Pickles. So, have you guys bugles, bugles. have you guys ever had big had bugles to snack? Bugles, yes. Yeah. Yes, those Actually, triangular really chip-like thing with cheesy flavor. Yeah. Yep. And then you can put them on your fingers. You know what's really good, what? and I didn't expect to be really good. Hey, it's got level. Caramel flavored. Nice. Caramel flavored bugles. Wh what? Caramel flavored bugles? Yes, that sounds like it would be so disgusting, and yet it was so good. Oh my goodness, I want some. Oh, but those figs are so high in fat! Ugh. That's why you only eat a few. I know, right? But they're so good that the temptation is to eat the whole bag at once. <laughs> Jeez, I, I can't look out for those caramel flavor bugles. Or... I don't know if they still sell them. They might have been limited. I kind of hope they aren't, though. I don't know. I haven't had bugles in years. Me neither. I have to look them up. I mean, sometimes you have stores, but I don't buy them because they're... Not very healthy, and I try to eat somewhat healthy. Come on, Sun Robin. Can do it's it. still outside of rage. So, what do I have Paula like here? Maybe. But they're just gonna go, gonna go, gonna go for Est. Wait, oh yeah, just heal Est, like right now. And they'll just surround her and then just die. <laughs> Yep, you know, I think we've seen enough of the, of the bouncing eyeballs. Oh look, she's getting 5 experience now. I can turn off animations. 
just heal her up, just so that she doesn't get too low. Alright. Okay, let's hope the jail actually moves downwards. Probably. Yes. That's only briefly faster. Oh, so many summons. Yep. That's why we put. If only I could turn these into or. I know, right? With how many that there are right I, now. I wonder if we're going to ever introduce monsters into Fire Emblem Heroes. That could be interesting. I feel like if they do, they'd end up running on the. Uh, Don't you want to play as a big one? No, the same system that. Uh, Lagoos eventually will. They they have to add Lagoos at some. Do they though? I mean, it's not like they're they were that popular characters. I mean, they could just be like. What system do you mean though? Well, I know well, that's the thing. They already have this though, like kind. Of, well, no, never mind. I was gonna say they don't. I mean, they have the dragons. Like, yeah. would they change it? Like, cause they had like a timed system with them. As opposed I to using Lag stones. I meant, Lagu's, I meant Lagu's as in transforming characters. So well, no, no, because Lagu, Lagu's like worked in a particular way. Like they don't work like recent titles. Yeah, like, there, the there's there, there's no way they're gonna do something like that in Heroes. I'm guessing they're just gonna be like, like they're gonna be like they're gonna be basically like dragons, except physical. So they're like out. So they're like they're like I guess immune to the breakers, but they're physical. I don't know. That would be cool if they made like a neutral dragon or like a neutral beast stone user. Like maybe their attacks would be slightly less strong because they're not strong against anything. But can Robin do it? Can I was actually it? thinking. I was actually thinking that Lagu would be colorless physical. Yeah. Melee, because we don't have a colorless physical. Melee. Yeah, basically. So we, oh yeah, it got all twenty four XP. <sighs> but anyway, with the current number of. Biggles that are on screen right now. Yes. Two, four, six, eight, ten. And now Just I gotta make wait. Sure that, like, the ten. Test is like right in the middle. Twelve, fourteen, fifteen. So I could summon three units with the number of Biggles that are on screen now. Okay, let me guess. Odin, Niles, and Fur. All three star. There you go. Why would I? Why would I crack open a blue or a red when I'm after three? Well, that's who I seem to get a lot. I counted today. I think I have about nine, nine furs. Wait, actually, is fur is fur red? Yes. I think she's a sword user. Yes. Okay, yeah. So I, I did my math right. Okay, fine. Niles, Riss, and then Niles. There you go. That's what you're getting. Uh, probably. With knowing my luck. <laughs> See, here's the problem. Like, Robin can't kill him, but I can't weaken him to the point where he does because. <laughs> Maybe I should move some more units over to help instead of just having him sit back. How about so that? Easy. Huh? Our team is so lazy. It's been a long and hard war, okay? Some of them don't even have a lot of HP. Yeah, I, I guess. We need some healing. Yeah. <laughs> ah, jeez, could have, I could have healed, healed with Salika. So Salika, <laughs> Jinx, you owe me a soda. <laughs> Although you probably didn't hear us speak at the same time, because I just realized. Why are you sending her back? I don't know. Um, so what was I gonna say? Put her into the heart of the pickles. I'm not sure how relevant this is to the Let's Play, but I'm debating on whether or not I want to code a bot for Echoes. 
I mean, th th I mean, without without pair ups and second gen, is there even much of a reason? That was my thought when I when Echoes first you know. got revealed. But then there's like there's so much like there's the overclass. There's it wouldn't be mo it would mostly not be for characters. It would mostly be for items because of the way. Uh, forging works in Honestly, I Echoes. Don't think it will. I don't think it's worth it. It's up to you. I don't think it's worth it, but if you enjoy coding, sure. Oh yeah, I haven't even ran into forging. I never used forging in the other games though. Oh come on! Seriously! Stop summoning! Don't you just love how broken this is? I know, summonings are like the single worst thing about guided. It's not the wide open maps, not the reused maps. Summoning. And I already even made a video on this. I and that was before I got to this point. But yes, it's summoning is so annoying, I made a rat video about it. <laughs> and guess what? It's still in Echoes. Although it's. I don't Although know. It, yeah, it, it wasn't actually like as bad to me personally, but still, like it was still kind of annoying. Yeah, and yeah. the thing is, like this I one. Didn't say it was nerfed though it was just other things were buffed so that it seemed like it was less of a hassle mm -hmm. i don't think summoning itself was nerfed see the problem yeah, see it, i've, it I've, I've almost eliminated you'll still got like a bunch of summons per turn yeah. see i've like <laughs> almost eliminated this group but then the other group is getting bigger see how the heck am i That's supposed why... to level up robin it's not gonna work, like, honestly. Thought. Just send in Paula, like... This isn't really gonna work out. Jeez. But yeah, no, stop summoning? How else am I gonna get Brian Cordelia? Just have Paula go in there, heal her right now. Oh, the big dodged, wonderful. Yeah. She's gonna take a bunch of damage. Time to get physical. Jeez, it's taking much longer than it should. It's not like our other units will do much damage to them anyway. Then again, some of these maps can potentially be just annoying because of the fatigue system and echoes. Oh yeah, fatigue exists. Like, I've barely ran into that once. Like, I've only had that happen once. It's not an actually, issue when you're in dungeons. Just yeah. I was gonna say, it is kind of more of an issue in dungeons, but I didn't even run into that very often in dungeons. Like, I did well, the fight, I did the, I did the I game. told you about the issue that I had in Act 6. Yeah. Please no, please no talk about Act 6. I just told you, it's just, it's just a dungeon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, I'm not gonna tell okay, you the story so they only like summoned, summoned one. But yeah, it was a pain because of the dungeon. Well, that's okay, you just need to stock up on holy cheese. I mean... Or any other... Cheese. You know, I just realized, like, some characters, of course, have specific foods that they oh. like more than others. Yeah. I wonder if there's a list yet. There is on, on Serene's. I ran into, oh my goodness. What was it that apparently, surprised me? Apparently, oh. Silk likes it rough. And she May likes carrots. May likes, May likes leftover bread. She gets power and defense every time. This is amazing. Some I remember like some units like had so refined taste. They got like really annoying. Like Luca has like really refined taste for whatever reason. Well, he is a backwater noble. I mean, but still, like, he, like, he, like, he probably, he should have known what he was getting into. He shouldn't be picky. You know, Lucas is one of my favorite characters in Echoes. He's just like a, he's alright. He's just like a really cool dude, but he's also like smart, well-spoken. He's a good guy. He's a bro. Yeah, Lucas is pretty cool. Come on, can you please, please? Just send us into that 
<laughs> giant pile of pickles and heal her. <laughs> and then Paul can take over like on that other side. So so much for promoting Rawfit. If only that general gave like double the XP that he did. Okay, we're getting there. Nope. 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 Oh, nope. <laughs> yeah. That's why we're gonna put them right there. In the middle of all of Okay, so it went from having 8 to having 13. So yeah, just send Est in there, I'm like, where she's in... <laughs> where she's in range of I'm most of them. Three units. So, like... And then heal Paula again. Again, again! Because she takes so much damage. But by so much, we be three. Darn it, I, uh, I summoned the wrong guy. You didn't summon anything. I healed the wrong dude. You didn't summon it. So do I send, like, Paula no, in there, or first let's No, see. leave her there. Jeez, I did not expect this map to take an hour. Because I if you move her that way, these guys are not going to be in range of any of them, and they're probably going to summon even more. So you want to take up these two? Her yes, right there. Yeah, it's all like, you know, oh, Jen is gone. This is going to be nice and easy. Oh boy, this is a problem. Nope. Yep. Oh, I just left May there. <sighs> oh my. I really did not think this level would take this long. Yeah, my yeah. thing is just making sure that, that they are in range of your units so that they'll attack them instead of summoning. Please. Like, if only they were getting group XP for Robin, right? That'd be great. I mean, that's kind of how it works now. And it goes no. It's post map. Yeah, you get a post map, so it wouldn't help him level up. But th there's that. Eventually, yeah. Yes. If you want to level up on this map, that would help. I guess it's easier to get interface-wise and in, in, in need for. You can't level up from group XP anyway, but that's cool. You just have Rom take like, one shot and get one XP. Come on, keep going. Jeez. This is the game telling you you need to grab. What? How does how does grinding help? <laughs> this is... I mean, the peg the pagans one shot the biggles anyway, so grinding doesn't help at all. And the rest of the units would need to like, even if they're at max level, they probably wouldn't do very well against biggles. Okay, if they were at if they got to like twenty level per only, they might. But okay, let's heal Paulette first. I absolutely need to heal. How many are we at now? Eight? Okay, we're back to eight. Just make sure that all of them are in range. That probably wasn't a good idea. Uh-huh. Probably just want to put us in there. Who has 19 health? Put her up there. Yeah. Down to six. Five. Dead. Four. Don't count them until they're dead. There we go, let's level up. And she got powered. Okay, cool. Yeah, because she went this, right? Right? I called it. 
Don't jinx it. And two of them did not attack at all. Three of them didn't attack at all, but still. I'll attack them now. Yes. Oh boy. The core's healing polish should be a priority. And that may have made fixing a more complex. See, if Paula hit those two, we would be down at one. And now we have to heal. I almost thought you were gonna heal the Biggle. <laughs> can you heal enemies? I don't think you can I don't heal. think you can. Cause like, the way the UI is built, you totally... You totally could, but it's probably it probably would just. Wait a minute, Robin. Or... Can you do this, Robin? Can. Well, do any amount of experience can help. It's just. Can Jesse reach? Well, look. Yeah, Je one, two, no. three, four. So I'll have to block off with Jesse. How much damage would Jesse take? Twenty-four. Probably a lot. Quant. We need to quantify that. Eighteen speed. Eagle has 18 speed, so he will take 5 damage. Yeah, I can do that. <sighs> That's if they go after them. I just realized, how does effective damage work in this game? It, I think it multiplies by some amount that I'm, that I'm not sure of. Okay, because I know that in later games, it's it's weapon might times 3, but you, you can hold something other than a weapon in this game. Yeah, because you have natural from the class. What about like anti flyer skill? And echoes. Okay, sweet. Although we're probably not gonna get the level of prob in, but okay. Okay, it's cool. Can we do this? Yeah, finally. <laughs> Can anyone do a little, like, very little damage so that he yeah. can take it out? Yeah, Je Jesse will do 10 damage, I believe. Yes. Come on, this is gonna level prop, but I actually bet it Come won't. Come on, Robin! Well, we're gonna get 22 XP. I'm, like, 90% sure it won't. No. Are you flipping KDB? Turn wheel thing! What if we leave it alive and maybe it'll multiply? Why would you want this? Well, if it multiplies, we could take out two of these two, and then we could... Here, just do it. Do it. End turn. End your turn. Mm. Well, heal Jesse first. Eh. I'm worried about Robert getting doubled, though. But Robert would get doubled. But then, if Robert gets... If we, then he'll kill it. He'll do... H times two. What, what will... What will the, um... Biggle do to Robin? Eight, eight times two. If, I, if can just, I can just I can just block. Attack. Okay, that works. But but then okay, it's going to probably the Biggle is going. Attack. If the Biggle attacks Eddywood, it's gonna die. What if it's Robin? Okay, yeah. you know what? Yeah, we, we we leave Robin open. I guess I guess I'll heal Jesse. Sure, I just want to level up Robin. That's no ma. Okay, well let's hope it falls for the bait and it gets Robin and then watch him get like 8 experience. Come on. Yes. Hello? Unnecessary crit. And it got 8 experience exactly as I expected. So much for leveling up Robin, but we conquered Judah. And look at this, more Durg Zobs for all. Which we will probably not do on screen. Yes, <laughs> which we will not, Holy but like... Cats. I can't even tell if their numbers are increasing, but look at that. This is ridiculous. <laughs> oh my goodness. You uh, might want to make a save state. <laughs> Yeah, well, anyway, you guys can see what's gonna happen. It's basically just gonna be Lucas and Alm down there after I warp Alm. 
And on the right side is gonna be Claire, and they're just gonna slowly but surely take care of it. It's just like the Biggles, except they won't respawn. And yeah, that's Thank gonna be that. that. Yeah. Can you imagine if Dragons See. split up? Oh my goodness. Not even Kaga is that sadistic. So yeah, that's that, and that is gonna be more than enough for this episode. So, I'm not even sure what we're gonna do next time. But that has been taken care of Jeddah, except not really because he escaped, and more importantly, the Biggles. So this has been Snow and Friends. Yeah, if you enjoyed the video, give it a like, comment, let me know what you think, if you had fun watching me take on his horde of eyeballs. And this is Steel Knight, signing off.